Hello children, here I am back again with your grammar lessons. Today we are going to learn about articles and pronouns. So let us start with articles. What are articles? A and the are called articles. Articles are used with nouns. A and an are used with vowels and the is used with consonants. So, let us see what are vowels and consonants. Children, there are 26 letters in English language. Out of 26, 5 are vowels and 21 are consonants. Here, what are vowel letters? A, E, I, O, U are five vowel letters. Rest of the letters are consonant letters. I hope children, it is clear to you. Now, let us move to the articles. There are two types of articles, definite and indefinite articles. Definite article is the. Indefinite articles are e and an. We use e and an before singular nouns. We write a before words beginning with consonant sounds. We use an before words beginning with vowel sounds. For example, a house and apple. Here, the word how started with consonant letter. So, article A is used. The next word apple is started with vowel letter. So, article an is used. Children, we say a useful thing because useful is pronounced with the consonant sound Y. Here, the word useful started with the vowel letter. But it pronounced with the consonant sound Y. Similarly, we say an honest man because H in honest is silent. The word begins with the vowel sound O. Now, let us start the exercise of the lesson. Write A or an before the words A, B. The word B started with consonant letters, so we have to use article A. B1, university. University is started with vowel letter, but it pronounced like U. So, we have to use article A. C, cantle. The word cantle started with consonant letters, so we have to use A. D1, donkey. Donkey is started with consonant letters, so we have to use article A. E, lamp. Lamp is also a consonant letter word, so we have to use article A. F, sheep. Sheep is also a consonant letter word, so we have to use article A. G, umbrella. Umbrella is started with a vowel letter. So, we have to use article an. H. Ice cream. This word also started with vowel letters. So, we have to use an. I. Phone. This word started with consonant letters. So, we have to use the article a. J. Ocean. This word started with vowel letters. So, we have to use article an. K. King. King started with consonant letters, so we have to use article A. Gift. This word also is a consonant letter word, so we have to use article A. M. Orange. This word started with vowel letters, so we have to use article N. N. Pen. This word also started with a consonant letter, so we have to use article A. O, ogre. This word is a vowel letter word, so we have to use an. P, zoo. 
This word is a consonant letter word. So, we have to use article A. Igloo. This word is a vowel letter word. So, we have to use article AN. Book. This word is a consonant letter word. So, we have to use article A. Tiger. This word also is a consonant letter word. So, we have to use article A. T. Iguana. Iguana is a vowel letter word. So, we have to use article AN. U. Engine. Engine is a vowel letter word. So, we have to use article AN. Children. We use the when it is clear which thing or person we are talking about. For example, who was the girl you are talking to at the store? Here, it is clear that which girl and which store. Now, second, when we talk about people or things in particular. For example, we are talking about one person, yeah, one thing, yeah, one time. That is called Particular. The sun rose at 6.17 a.m. today. Here we are talking about a particular thing that is the sun. Next, the prime minister will be addressing the nation from the red fort. Here we are talking about particular person, particular country and particular building. With the names of famous buildings or monuments. For example, have you been to the Taj Mahal? Taj Mahal is a monument. The monuments, we have to use the article the. With names of rivers, oceans and seas. For example, the Ganga, the Indian Ocean, the Arabian Sea. With names of deserts and forests. For example, the Thar Desert, the Sundarbans. With names of newspapers, for example, the Times of India. With names of trains, for example, the Rajdhani Express. Children, let us revise once again the uses of the. The used for specific objects or objects that both the speaker and the listener know. For example, can you give me the books on the table. The book is on the table. We know that book is on the table. We are talking about that um, particular book, that object. The is used when we mention the objects again. The movie is based on a real life incident. The is used before plural countries or other plural region and bodies of water. For example, the Netherlands. The is used with proper names of books, oceans, seas, rivers, canals, bridges, mountain ranges, etc. Now, let us do the exercise of the lesson. Fill in the blanks with A, and or the. A. English is not an easy language. Here the word easy is started with vowel letters. So we have to use article and. B1. Is Australia an island? Here the word island is also a vowel letter word. So we have to use article and. C. Sanya left after and a. Here a started with consonant letter but uh, h is silent here and this word begins with the vowel sound o. So article and is used. Now d. I read the story a year ago. Here year is a consonant letter word. So we have to use article a. Uh. Now e. The Ganga is a holy river. Here the Ganga is the name of a river. So we have to use article the. And is a holy river. Holy is a consonant letter word. So we have to use article a. Now f. 
Mr. Sheshadri was the principal of our school. We are talking about the principal. That's a particular person. So we have to use the. Now G. The Indian Ocean is to the south of India. Here also particular um, ocean. Name of ocean and south of India. Particular name of a place. So we have to use the in both the places. Now H. One morning, a visitor knocked at my door. Here, visitor is a consonant letter word. So, we have to use article A. I. Japanese is the language of the people of Japan. Here, we are talking about the particular language and particular people. So, we have to use the. Now, J. In case you meet your sister, Give her the gift I gave you. Here, talking about the particular gift. So, we have to use article the. Now, there is a homework. Warm up exercise from page number 26. You have to do as homework. Now, children, we will learn about pronoun. It is in worksheet number 8. Children, what is a pronoun? A pronoun is a word that used in place of a noun. If we didn't have pronoun, we would have to repeat the nouns again and again. Pronouns can do all of the things that nouns can do. Read these sentences. Sanjay is my brother. He is four years old. Rani is a good girl. She does her homework regularly. Here, he and she are pronounced because they are used instead of the nouns Sanjay and Rani. He and she are used in place of Sanjay and Rani. We, we use the pronouns for non-living things as well as for the animals also. For example, my pet's name is Bruno. It likes bones. Here, Bruno is not repeated in the second sentence. In place of Bruno, it is used. Now, let us do the exercise. Now, fill in the blanks with the correct pronouns. Mangoes are delicious. They grow on trees. Here, the noun mango is not repeated in the second uh, sentence. In place of mangoes, the pronoun they is used. Now B. Anita is a famous singer. She has sung many songs. Here, in place of Anita, she is used in the second sentence. C. The boy is so tall that he will easily reach the shelf. In the place of the boy, he is used in this sentence. Now D. The lion is roaring because it is hungry. In this sentence, in place of lion, it is used. Now E. Tanu and I are cousins. We study in the same school. Here, in place of Tanu and I, pronoun V is used. Now F. Pankaj and Ajay study in the same school. They are classmates. In this sentence, in place of Pankaj and Ajay, the pronoun they is used. Now G. You can go to play as long as you complete your homework. In this sentence, pronoun you is used. Children, the pronoun I, we, he, she, it, they, you and we are used in place of the subject of the sentence. The pronoun that comes in place of the subject of the sentence are called subject pronouns. Rewrite these sentences replacing the bold words with subject pronouns. A. Summer gave me a new pen. What is the subject here? Summer. Summer is the name of a boy. So we have to use pronoun he. This pronoun came in place of the subject of the sentence. So it is a subject pronoun. He gave me a new pen. B. The villagers are looking for their watchmen. Here, in place of the villages, we use the pronoun they. They are looking for their watchmen. 
they is a subject pronoun because it came in the place of the subject of the sentence see seema and raina are friends in this sentence seema and raina is subject in place of seema and raina the pronoun they is used they are friends d the pen writes well here the subject is the pen so in place of the pen um, pronoun it is used it writes well e jina has many books subject of this sentence is jina so in place of jina she is used she has many books f abhishek is a good boy subject of this sentence is abhishek so in place of abhishek we have to use the pronoun he now let us move to next read these sentences this book belong to him they want to play with me she made this painting for us the highlighted words are used in place of objects in the sentences we already learned about subject now we are learning about objects of the sentence the pronouns that come in place of the objects of the sentence are called object pronouns children the object in a sentence is like the person or thing receiving the action of the subject now let us study the table subject pronoun and object pronoun i i is the subject pronoun for that me is the object pronoun you is the subject pronoun for that you is the object pronoun he is the subject pronoun for that him is the object pronoun she is the subject pronoun for that her is the object pronoun they is the subject pronoun for that them is the object pronoun it is the subject pronoun for that it is the object pronoun now let us do the exercise of the lesson fill in the blanks with the correct object pronouns from the box them it you her him me are the objects pronouns in the box a the cushion is on the sofa you are sitting on it in place of cushion what is the object pronoun used it here it b preeti wanted to have ice cream the waiter handed the cone to her in place of subject preeti object pronoun her is used see mother bought apples before eating wash them properly here in place of apple object pronoun them is used d shilpi is good at maths i will ask her for the answer here for shilpi object pronoun her is used e the sarkas returned home all the neighbors came to meet them here for the sarkas object pronoun them is used f this is a lovely dress from which store did you buy it here for the dress object pronoun it is used g this is my notebook i write important things in it here for the notebook object pronoun it is used h excuse me are you talking to me here for the subject i object pronoun me is used now let us do the next exercise replace the highlighted nouns with subject or object pronouns a raja went for a walk in the park in this sentence subject is highlighted so subject pronoun is used here he went for a walk in the park b he loves to play chess with beena in this sentence object is highlighted so object pronoun is used here he loves to play chess with her c karna will go for his tabla class lessons c karna will go for his tabla lessons in this sentence subject is highlighted so subject pronoun he will go for his tabla lessons d mother will take sana and rana 
for a film. Here object is highlighted so object pronoun is used. Mother will take them for a film. E. Make sure you apologize to Sunny. Here object is highlighted so object pronoun is used. Make sure you apologize to him. F. Surya is my best friend. In this sentence, subject noun is highlighted, so subject pronoun. He is my best friend. G. Do not forget to call the neighbors. In this sentence, object noun is highlighted, so object pronoun is used. Do not forget to call them. H. Take this card along with you. In this subject, subject noun is highlighted, so subject pronoun is used. Take it along with you. I, Riti and Ratha are coming to the party. Here also subject is highlighted, so subject pronoun is used. They are coming to the party. J, all the work was done by Purva and me. In this subject, object noun is highlighted, so object pronoun is used. All the work was done by us. Now let us read these sentences. That book is mine. She is not aware of the things that are hers. The blue house is us. The highlighted words tell who are the owner of these things. Pronouns which tell us who owns things are called possessive pronouns. Now let us study the table. For the subject pronoun I, object pronoun is me and possessive pronoun is mine. For the subject pronoun you, object pronoun is you and possessive pronoun is yours. For the subject pronoun he, object pronoun is him and possessive pronoun is his. For the subject pronoun she, object pronoun is her. And possessive pronoun is hers. For the subject pronoun they, object pronoun is them. And possessive pronoun is theirs. For the subject pronoun it, object pronoun is it. And possessive pronoun is its. Now let us do the exercise. 5. Fill in the blanks with a possessive pronoun for the nouns in the brackets. There are uh, nouns given in the bracket. We have to write possessive pronouns for that nouns. A. These toys are theirs. What are the nouns given in the bracket? Mita and Rajiv. In place of Mita and Rajiv, possessive pronoun theirs is used. B. These cycles are us. Noun in the bracket is us's and mine. In place of us's and mine, possessive pronoun Ours is used. See, Radha said, this diary is mine. Noun in the bracket is Radha's. In place of Radha's, possessive pronoun, mine is used. D. Anil's score is more than his. Noun in the bracket is Nikhil's. So, in place of Nikhil's, is is used. E. These are my colors. Where are yours? Noun in the bracket is Tupriti. In place of to Preeti, possessive pronoun yours is used. F. This expensive necklace is us. Noun in the bracket is aunts. So in place of aunts, possessive pronoun hers is used. Now let us read the next sentences. This is a tasty bun. These are bright flowers. Look at that. Those are naughty children. The highlighted words point at things. This points at a person or thing nearby. That points at a person or thing far away. These points at people or things nearby. Those points at people or things far away. Pronouns which point at a particular thing or things are called demonstrative pronouns. Now let us do the exercise. Fill in the blanks with the correct demonstrative pronouns in brackets. There are demonstrative pronouns given in the bracket. We have to choose the correct one. A. This is my favorite song. What are the demonstrative pronouns given in the bracket? This and that. 
So, correct one is this. B. This is the store that sells bicycles. Here, uh, demonstrative pronouns given in the bracket are those and this. So, we have to choose the correct one. So, this is uh, used in this sentence. C. That is the biggest egg I have ever seen. That and those. This sentence talking about one egg. So, that is used. D. Those are naughty boys. In this and those. In this sentence talking about boys. Boys is in plural. So, those is used. E. Throw away those socks. Those are stinking. Subject pronouns given in the bracket are these and those. We are talking about those socks. So, we are using those in this sentence. Now, there are some homework for you. First one, warm-up exercise you have to do as homework. Then, study the table of subject pronoun and object pronoun from page number 32. Study the table of subject pronoun, object pronoun and possessive pronoun from page number 34. I hope children, these lessons are clear to you. Till we meet... Take care yourself.